Hi everyone, uh, today I'm going to be showing you what's in my match bag. Uh, I've got this new Yule Sport goalkeeper holdle. Uh, I'll do another video separately for my training kit because that is uh, quite a bit different. Uh, but this is today uh, what's in my match bag. So, open up the holdle. I've done a separate review on this holdle which you can watch on the channel. So you won't believe how much, how much stuff we can get in here. Um, okay, first of all, my goalkeeper glove bag that I take out onto the pitch. Um, I'll show you separately. Okay, these, I love these. These are Storelli sliders. Um, very thin, about three or four mil padding on the hips and down the sides and um, slightly goes around the back as well um, but really nice tight lycra snug fitting shorts elasticated band um, good for firm ground warm weather where you don't want lots of padding um, but just a little bit to take off the sting on some of those dives so a pair of Storelli sliders I also have, because I've suffered a, a couple of fractured ribs in my time, I have this McDavid padded undershirt. Again, lycra, um, nice tight fitting. The shoulder pads I didn't particularly want, um, but they're there. The main thing I needed were these side pads that wrap right around the front of the rib cage, um, where I've had a couple of fractured ribs on uh, on this left hand side. It does have padding on the elbows as well, but a really nice shirt to wear, and it has helped me um, to take a few uh, body barges, I shall say, going up to catch from corners, um, attackers coming in for a header, and um, elbows and knees come flying in. So that really helps um, take some of the impact out of that and protect the ribs. Okay, we then have, sticking with the undergarments, we have a pair of, um, these are Yule Sport, matching the bag, padded knees, padded hips, padded sides, elasticated bottoms, um, so they don't hook around uh, your feet like the old saddle straps used to, they can be a bit annoying. Um, so these just fit snugly around the ankles and uh, don't pop out the top of the socks like some of the three quarter um, padded bottoms do. Elasticated band, string to tighten up. Um, they're really nice um, for hard ground or winter, winter weather. Shin pads, again, your sport. Um, you will notice I do tend to favour the specialist goalkeeper brands, your sport, Royce, etc. Um, produce really good kit specifically for goalkeepers. Um, these are nice, thick shin pads um, called tibia plate to protect the uh, tibia bone. Um, as you can see, Velcro straps top and bottom. Uh, these are a, a large size. Um, I'm six foot two roughly, so large size shin pads, the medium ones tend to come up a bit too small. So it's those. Over the top, my current club team socks, bright yellow. Then we have match gloves. Again, I've done a separate review of these, Yule Sport Ergonomic RF, super soft, um, really, really nice gloves. Um, keep them in the bag, tend to keep the zip open or half open, uh, a bit of ventilation in there. We even have a ball in here. Um, this is a bit like pulling the bunny out of the magician's hat. <laughs> so much stuff in here. Uh, football. Now, underneath, we also have another compartment to keep all the wet gear, 
dirty gear after the game. So, in here I can get a pair of boots, orange and black, match the gloves. They're a firmer ground molded stud boot. Also have another pair in there. These are studded boot. These are a uh, concave vault boot. Uh, very nice fitting, quite tight. Not too keen on the lacing of them. Um, it can be a bit fiddly, but um, yeah, a nice boot to use. And that's obviously for more wet weather, soft ground. And then finally, towel and shower gel. So all that in that bag, 80 litre bag, um, gets me set up for, for the match. Lastly, almost forgot, inside there is a small compartment here that zips up. Uh, I keep in there essentials like deep heat for muscle pain, another version of deep heat, muscle rescue, sock tape, I always put sock tape on, hold my socks up above the shin pads, um, yellow, match team colours, and blue. Finger tape, just to protect my knuckles, had a few uh, broken fingers and uh, bent back fingers, so finger tape just helps there. And then lastly, a couple of stud keys. In my glove bag that I actually take out onto the pitch, and this has a back small compartment. In there, again, I'll have spare stud keys, um, maybe a roll of tape, um, just in case the socks come down. Inside the main compartment, match gloves. These are my wet weather gloves. I've done a separate review on these. These are really, really good for wet weather. Amazing gloves. Um, and a towel, if it is wet weather, try and keep the hands as dry as possible. A um, little bit moist, because that always helps with the grip, but try and uh, keep most of the, the water off um, using that. So, so I hope you enjoyed that. I'll do another review on my training kit and um, I will see you soon. Press like and subscribe if you want to see more. Thank you.